right, man, what we here, we about to pick up the Hell Keezy, man. Bro, I get so confused sometimes, I'll be wanting to call a Hell Keezy the bloody right cat. <laughs> Shit. Like, what the hell you that motherfucker's in jail. <laughs> it's incarcerated. We're here, we're here to bond this motherfucker out too, shit. <laughs> shit, that hell, he been in that motherfucker all weekend, shit. We gotta nice. bond this ass out. Hi. Hi, how you doing? I'm here to pick up my Hellcat. Okay. We have a Hellcat? Do you have your registration? It's all in the car. Okay. Let me go back there and grab it. What color is it? Only Hellcat back there, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure too. Alright. <laughs> you got it? You got it? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Right, thank, you thank you very much. You got your ID on you? Yeah, I do. They said when they got told that all he was paying was the hook and tow or whatever, they said it wasn't being impounded, it was being, uh, I forget what the hell. Y'all still charge about a day though? Yeah. See it's what I'm saying? 15 oh, a day for um, 30 day holds or it's 30 to 50 a day for everything else. Plus whatever the tow is. What's the tow usually? 250? Uh, no, usually it's 165. I'm not showing any paperwork on a Hellcat though. Maybe they goofy ass didn't even know it was a Hellcat. Maybe they just put it as Challenger. Because the cop that did it, it was embarrassing like that. Here it is. Is it like a. It changes colors and stuff. Yeah, alright, I can. Yeah. Thank you, appreciate that. They didn't put it as a Hellcat, did they? Yeah, he was a goofy ass little hater, so. Yeah, he had, his, he had his glass like this, and he was like, hang it down, he was a little tight, sticking the booty up. They did, oh yeah, they can't, they was embarrassing anyway. So, they just wanted to impound it, just to impound it. Yeah, you know, you got some nice shit, that's what people like to do. Oh, my driver could help Oh, the driver did? Oh, see, he knew. Yeah, yeah he knew. He ain't burning my ties, did he? No. <laughs> <laughs> my fucking <is> expensive. <laughs> yeah, of course. You want my license? Um, yeah, I will need that one. Unless you gonna take my word for it. Ah, you need it. Oh, that's all good. I'm just playing. Yeah, I hope that, hope that weird ass cop watching too. I know that cop probably watching the video right now. Pull it over, cause your car's going. <laughs> <laughs> he couldn't get his story to yeah, him. He, he, he was so embarrassing, so damn. I just need that registration then. Um and it's two sixty two fifty. Okay, see so I said about I said, I said two fifty. Yeah, you just said about two fifty. Can I get more props, bro? Yeah, you get some props, bro. <laughs> I'm sorry, what's that? Can you pay with the card? Yeah. Alright, I got one more card for you then. Okay, is it extra money? Okay, shit, goddamn. You know what I mean? <laughs> Shot the seller. You know what I mean? This is just so I can rent the card for the towing fees. Okay. Right? We use this for everybody, so some of it's for companies and shit. So just whatever pertains to you. Shit, ain't trying to get me a lot more. been trying to get me lately. Damn, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, boy. Damn, put it in as a Hellcat. All this for what, though? All this for nothing, Jeremy. All right. Ain't that dumb as hell? Mm hmm. Oh, yeah. Oh, you know what? Fantastic. It was good before they ass came around. Yeah, then they sent me to jail. And then they yeah. sent me to jail, too, so goddammit. You know, that's the cost of being legendary, you know what I mean? A lot of people don't like that shit, you know? It's all right, though. It's just in the blood. I got the drip in the blood, I got the hate in the blood. So, you know, just <laughs> totally different kind of people from two totally different spectrums of the world, baby. That's all. Sometimes the cops are assholes and Oh, no, sometimes. No, 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 no. You know what? I never ran to the city police here, but I'm gonna speak for the state troopers because this guy was a state trooper. Big dick head. Like yeah. Cops are the worst. Yeah, no, they're they're pretty smooth laid back. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? This dude right here though, full dick head. Full of, like meat potato head, like right? <laughs> you ever see potato head from uh in Toy Story? Yeah. Look just like it. <laughs> 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 yeah. uh, let's see. Yeah. I need a copy of it. Copy of what? The registration. How do I get that? Go to Minnesota. Um, because I don't think that can do it here. I'm trying to think. Do you have anybody that's over there or online? Because I can do it for Service Arizona, man. Okay, like you can go on there and you can literally email me a copy of your registration. I don't know if Minnesota has something like that though. I can say title or current registration. Those are the only two. So, I can probably do that right from the website where I, where I pay my payments on my car. Yeah. You should have, yeah, be able to do like a something with like, like the title 
like on there. They yeah. should be able to do something. Email it to me. I can give you my email address. I'm just gonna put it up on my phone right now. Okay. Or if I call it, can I call the people that? Call them. And that's what I do right now. That's what we do. <laughs> Shit, goddamn. Motherfucking police boys, see what Motherfucking Dexter Laboratory ass police. You, know you ever see Jimmy Neutron? God damn, man. Boy, G. Yeah, boy, he went to Jesus, but he was big to do brain. That's what he was. God damn, man. He doing all this extra shit for nothing. Did I get that? Oh, yeah, I can make you a copy. Thank you. you. Yeah, you don't really want that. Yeah, I want all that. <laughs> I need all that. You know what I mean? Damn, man. I need five, over 500 damn dollars. To get my own damn car for some bullshit that the dicks are gonna do with Twig head that plants with the eyeball head ass wanna just do all that extra shit. You know what I'm mean? saying? It's okay though, bro. I got money. I was there. Then we thought he thought a black man with no money. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Got a little money, got a little something to count, baby. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> That's what he thought. I got more than you. <laughs> Guaranteed. <laughs> Nah, but what did he say in the booking? Oh, in the booking, the cop was like, uh, he was like, don't look like you're gonna make it out of this one. Cause you know, when they were all huddled, they was all wild. He was looking at the YouTube videos and all that, they seemed to get pulled over. So he thought he was gonna be the one that was gonna be the game changer. Oh, I'm a lot tall guy up. No, nah, bro, look, listen, I'm smarter than you. I got a degree like you in criminal justice. So, and my brother's a police officer. So, I need to just go ahead and relax because you messed with the wrong one this time. So, you know, that's what, that's what the court of law is for, though. You know what I'm saying? Go ahead, challenge you, give me a good little lawyer and all that. You know what I mean? Hope you show up, you know, because I'm going to be there on time early. You know, <laughs> early. I'm be on black people time, you think I'm going to be late? No, I'll be there early, baby. You're sitting there with you. you know what I'm going to help Keezy start up from the inside. Ooh, that thing was going to start. A little nice cold start, too. That thing been sitting all weekend. Yeah. That cold start going to be legendary. It's on its way up? Yeah. Okay. Another copy? Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Am I good to go? Okay. Well, thank you, ladies. Y'all have a good day. What happened is, Jim, this is probably what happened. Somebody probably looked like me, had that drip like me, probably banged out his wife. You know what I'm saying? Probably bullied him as a kid. You know? <laughs> so he probably think like, this looks like the guy who got me when I was a kid. He stole my girlfriend. So your ass is under arrest. And I'm going to say you were doing this, even though I don't know what you were doing. You were being legendary. <laughs> no, it's okay, champ. I know I might remind you of that guy, but I ain't that guy, champ. Continue to watch the videos, and for all the police out here watching the Phoenix, Arizona, and not necessarily all of them, because I don't think all of them are bad, but that guy right there gives good police officers like my brother a bad rep. My brother is a good, our brother is a good police officer, man, and the people that I've met that's in his unit, good police. I've never been pulled over by a cop and treated a cop rude, disrespectful, or nothing. So for him to do that to me, ain't no telling how many people we've done it to. I'm just a person with a voice who can fight back and say, this is not okay. You know what I mean? But ain't no telling how many people he done really this, this to for real, for real life. You know what I'm saying? So all jokes aside, if this shit ain't cool, you know what I mean? But he gives people, good police officers, a bad rep. Even the people, I guarantee people who all the police here in Phoenix ain't bad. I've came through Phoenix a million times and I've never uh, dealt with a cop like that dude. So I'm not saying all the cops here are bad, but that guy right there, he gives all the police here a bad name. And that's a fact. Look at the hell, man. Come on, baby, did you win? Hell no. You better relax. <laughs> Got the hell keys, he back, man. They not trying to take his shit, man. I got the hell keys in right now, brother. We're gonna have to call a Yaila again to get him to come through. Yep, just like that, man. We out of here. Hell keys, the bloody cat about to take off again. You can't stop us, baby. So we just got back to my brother's crib. You see the bloody cat, you see the hell keys, back in action. About to have my guy come out here and uh, clean this joint. But look at this, man. DP arrest, huh? <laughs> look at that. Is it real or is it real right here, Jeremy? It's real. Bro. Come on, man. Big time real, man. They done done that. You know what I mean? And it happened. So, anyway, man. Stay tuned for everything. Make sure you subscribe to my channel as you watch this video because I'm going to be giving you a lot more updates with the case and all that. Make sure you follow all social medias, Snapchat, Twitter, Instagram, and make sure y'all do the same. Subscribe to my brother's YouTube channel right there. Y'all see it floating right there. Subscribe right now. Swipe out this video and go subscribe. Follow him on Snapchat, Facebook, and Instagram. Yo, so this is my brother's first time trying Boston Market. Look how you're looking at it. <laughs>
Yeah. I rock with Boston Market Heavy, I ain't gonna lie. That's not what I was thinking when I was <laughs> planning on eating. <laughs> <laughs> Watch out, my bite you. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> he said it looks processed. Bro, what kind of meat is this though? This shit look like, it don't even look brown like ground beef. Brother, honestly, I can't even lie to you, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> But it's good. <laughs> All right, G Squad, and just like that, man, we are back at my brother's crib, man. You see the bloody cat sitting right here. Yes, that is a red hell cat. If you don't know, with white tire lettering, and then to its left, you have the hell keysy swapping and changing colors with the tire lettering. Tomorrow is my first court appearance. I'm gonna keep y'all updated throughout this whole case. Don't worry about one thing, man. We're gonna get through this G Squad, and I really appreciate every last body, every last person, I should say. I'm sorry, pardon me getting my words all tangled up. Every last person that donated to the campaign and hit that GoFundMe, man. All jokes aside, man, I don't think this is cool for me to be going through all this, but nonetheless, man, God puts his uh, toughest battle or his toughest soldiers through his toughest battles, man. So, in other words, man, God ain't gonna do nothing to me that I can't handle. You know what I'm saying? God gives his toughest battles to his toughest soldiers, man. So, I felt like, you know, maybe I'm the voice for the people, you know what I'm saying, that's been going through this, or whatever the case may be. I just know that God has a plan for me. He has a plan for us all, man, and I trust the process. And I believe in the process, man. Never question the process, man. Even when I was locked up in the cell, I told my family, I told my woman, I told uh, Jeremy, I told everybody, my nieces and nephews, when I was sitting in the back of a cop car, smiling like this, even though deep down inside I was really sad and I didn't really want to go back there. You know what I'm saying? It's like I smile because I know that God has a plan, man. And this is his plan that he has for me right now, man. But uh, all jokes aside, man, uh, tomorrow's the first court appearance, man. Like I told you, I'm going to keep you all updated and in the loop, man. Um, but after that, we are, uh, that's my uh, brother's wife in the Kia Soul. I'll be taking that uh, tomorrow. I think that might be Melissa in the car flicking her high beams at me, man. But um, after that, then I will be going to LA. And speaking of LA, shout out to my dog, uh, Dave at Real Deal Dog Training. And my guy, Jimmy at Rough House County Corso. That is my niece. And I was right, that is Melissa. Amari, you wanna come say hi? Come here, girl. Look at her. Amari is gonna come with so me. White. What'd you say? It probably looks so white. Like, you know, you light skinned girl, you looking uh, nice and golden. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> what they call that, uh, Melissa? Uh, golden brown. That's when they pull you out the oven and you're nice and golden brown. You said honey supple? <laughs> well, listen, funny, but listen, um, shout out to Real Deal Dog Trainer and my guy Jimmy uh, Mongoli. I ain't even trying to say your name. You're my guy, brother, but you got a tough name to pronounce on the last name. You know what I'm saying? Uh, shout out to both of them because that's where, if you're not G Squad, you don't know this. But um, I got two Connie Corsos. I got a black Connie Corso named King, and I got a blue Connie Corso uh, female. And her name is Queen. You know what I'm saying? Y'all got more coming too, so just stay tuned and in the loop, man. But um, after the first quarter appearance, I plan on going to LA and picking up Queen, and then uh, probably you know coming back to Phoenix and then going home back to Minnesota from there, man. But I'll keep y'all updated in the loop, man. So make sure y'all stay tuned for everything, man. And I'm gonna insert some clips at the end of this of uh, Real Deal Dog Training and everything they've been doing out there in Cali. Make sure you give them a follow. They do real good work with training with dogs. So I'm gonna insert that in there as well as I'm leaning up on the Hell Keezy. Why you just sitting there looking like looking like you possessed or something? You, you okay? Yeah. I'm All right. Yeah, look at my knee. She got so big. What you say? Has a hole in it. It does have a hole in it. You want me to get it? Hey, Melissa. What's up? Say hi to the G Squad. What? what? Follow Melissa on Instagram follow, and Snapchat. Don't, don't follow her. Why? Yeah, follow me. No. Why not follow her? Follow. Give her a good reason why not to follow her. Cause she doesn't need it. Yeah, she does. Oh, I need it. You heard no, the because, emphasis on. Because okay. All those guys Hit her line all the time. Yep. Hit her line all the time? Yeah. Okay, well, I what about you? I still got it, baby. You still got it, Melissa? I still got That's it. That's right. <laughs> you know what's funny? I'm going to keep it real. Melissa, have I been wanting to drive this car or this car around here? No. Nope. Why haven't I? Because those cops, man. Yep. Stop. Because I feel like I got a damn target on my back. And I told you, Melissa told me. I would. 
got the hamster car. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna start driving this damn car. You damn right. Because I told Melissa I didn't want to drive this. I wanted to go get something to eat the other day, and I didn't want to take my Hellcat because I just feel like cops gonna mess around and pull us over when them state troopers and pop pop. You know, and that's all they wrote. You know what I'm saying? We don't want that, do we? But you took it, though, did you? And what I say to you when you took it? <laughs> you said you better watch out. Follow her on Snapchat and Instagram. That's your, I know when you're 16, your dad told me he got that for you. Yeah. Look at it, you spoiled, girl. Yeah. You want to know what me and your dad's first car was? Big Humpty Dumpty Whip. Yeah, look like something that fell off a mountain. You know what I mean? <laughs> that was our car. Your dad actually had a real, a real life hole in the floor of his car. So if you put his foot through there too hard, his foot, yeah, you'd be Flintstone feet. So you ever see the movie Flintstones? I have to do that. Yeah, you know how you had to pedal? We had a couple cars that were paddle worthy. What do you say, Melissa? I'm gonna have to do that tomorrow to kickstart that thing. <laughs> Man, I don't know. Yeah. I just Pull can't wait to watch this video as you're driving to California. This thing's like. <laughs> <laughs> Look like the gerbils. Right, right. <laughs> <laughs> your, your fucking ass is gonna be sitting in the back seat for no, the front. That'd be hilarious. Well, you gotta get used to it anyway. You gonna come with me, right, Amari? Yeah. Yeah, so Minnie's gonna ride out with me as we go get King and all that good stuff. And you just drop it, and she's dropping. What's that white powdery substance right there? <laughs> Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh, Melissa. You know they watching me now. How'd you get that Hellcat, man? <laughs> you know that's what they think, right? Right, right. You know that's what they think. <laughs> no. Keep a, a strict cover, man. Yeah. <laughs> Shut the damn garage, you know what I'm saying? Wait, what are you guys talking about? What is that? That's, that's just uh, 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 what they call that. Uh, baking powder or baby powder is one of the two. No, it's baby food. Baby, is that baby food? It's oh, that's Similac? Yeah. Oh, okay. Similac. That was, that's what you used to have when you was a baby. Similac. No. No? Oh, you sucked on the boob? Yeah. Okay, okay. Well, dang, Marky. <laughs> you sucked on the nipple? Yes. <laughs> that's embarrassing. Yeah, that is kind of embarrassing, man. But anyway, man, I'm going to keep you all in the loop with everything, man. Stay tuned for the court uh, appearance going tomorrow and the update that's going to go up tomorrow. I'll put that video up tomorrow for y'all, man, when I actually go to court. Um, and every time I go to court, I'm going to update y'all. Keep you on the loop, man. But talk about car views. My beautiful niece Amari. Say bye. Bye. There y'all go, man. I'll see you on the next video, baby. I'm out of here.